up guys welcome to another video today we're reviewing friday the 13th part 5 a new beginning this one came out in 1985 and was directed by danny steinman and stars john shepherd and corey feldman now before we start over that like button subscribe and post notification bell so you can notify every video and let's get started let's start talking about the good so the opening sequence is a dream sequence and i thought it was good enough um it wasn't the best opening sequence of a friday the 13th film but it was Okay, it was decent. Um, the first act of the film um, is okay. Um, it's not it's not as good as it should have been. Um, didn't introduce the characters that well. Um, and it really didn't make you that invested to watch this entire film. Um, the death sequences in this film, they are... Um, they are less brutal than the ones in the other Friday the 13th films. Um, but the problem with them is that there's no tension leading up to those death sequences. It's just something happens and then you already know someone's around the corner and then they die. It's, it gets repetitive after a while, which makes it very, very boring and hard to watch. Um, because it's just the same thing over and over again, which is very unfortunate. Um, that's all the good that I have. Now let's move on to the bad. So the acting in this film is terrible. Every single actor and actress in, in this film, I thought they were horrible. Um, Corey Feldman is in this film. Um, he was he was good, um, but the rest of the characters were terrible. Um, I didn't find them interesting, and I never cared whether they lived or died because they had no character development. So you can't really get invested into a character if they don't have good character development. And fortunately, this film had terrible characters. Um, the third act of the film is extremely boring, and it's not tense. And that's a problem, because, first of all, the third act of the film is the final um, the final battle, you know, the um, possibly the biggest sequence in a film. And this one is just boring, which is very 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 bad because this is a horror film so you would expect it to be a big final battle in the third act of the film you know you have Jason Voorhees against um, another character and it should be entertaining at the least but it's it's not it's just boring and you can't wait to finish the film um, because that final battle is kind of long and very boring um, the ending sequence is very, very weird, and it had no, um, there was no development for that ending sequence throughout the entire film. There was zero development for that sequence, so it makes you, it just makes you wonder why they even made that choice for that ending sequence, because nothing that happened in that ending sequence was discovered or mentioned or, um, or foreshadowed. In the first second or possibly the beginning of the third acts so that ending sequence made no sense and I didn't like it um, that's about it Friday the 13th a new beginning is a very bland horror film um, I don't recommend checking this horror film out it's definitely the worst in the franchise and I'm gonna give Friday the 13th part 5 a new beginning a D Thank you for watching. Don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, post notification bell so you can never fail for your video. I'm Peter. Thank you for watching.